didn't even help with the stress at all. That's unfortunate. Oh my gosh, that is so much stress. Young lady's condition seems to be different from usual. I think I have a fever. It's so dizzy. No. This is big trouble. A young lady has gotten sick. This could ruin us. She's at 260 stress. Oh no. She's going to be a shell of her former self after this is over. So far, okay. Most things still... I know, she's sick. Okay. Go to the hospital, please. We gotta get this. Like, I mean, we don't have much money, but we need to use what we do have. We can go into a lot of debt if we have to. To get you better as soon as, as possible. Good, okay, so at the hospital, the stress goes away without reducing the other stats. It's not cheap, though. It is not cheap. One more round at the hospital, I guess. This is very bad. The lady's condition seems different from usual. Uh, I feel good today. I must have fully recovered. There you go. I'm glad that you've recovered. Okay, don't forget, uh, fancy dress. Woo. Okay. Okay, you gotta get some money. Quickly, um... Maid work. Mine work pays a lot, but I don't think... The issue with the bar is it reduces elegance. I can't be dealing with that. Okay. Say, Father, am I pretty? Do you think there is a chance for me to become a princess? Yes, definitely. Thank you, Father. Such sweet words. Hmm. Okay, uh, that ruined us financially, but stats for the most part survived, so... I guess that was, that was okay. Definitely not ideal, but we'll we'll manage. We'll manage. We are starting to run out of time, though. We only have 20 more weeks or whatever. I think they're actually more like half months in this game. So, uh... oh, good, a stipend. Good. We're not quite as ruined financially now. But, yeah, that is a very limited amount of time for her to, uh, seduce the prince. Uh, so, yeah. Father, happy birthday! Oh, an embroidered tablecloth. 45 gold, okay. More pride, elegance, and attitude. Okay. Okay. That's nice. Some extra pride is probably good. Okay. Alright, it's one week at the, or time period or whatever, 
at the palace. Um, Father, I have a favor to ask. Uh, I want to go to a dance class. Will that be alright? Sure. Yay, I love you so much, Father. Great. Oh, this is coming down to the wire. And I don't even, like, I haven't looked up any, oh my gosh, you are terrible at this job. Everything's up. Cool. I'm, uh, somewhat concerned. Like, I haven't looked up anywhere how this is actually supposed to be done. I'm just trying to kind of intuit the game, which maybe that's the wrong way to go about this, but that's what I'm going for. Um, and I'm record I'm trying to record like this whole thing like at once, so yeah, any comments to help are probably going to be of little use to me, especially by this point. Oh my gosh, that takes up so much money. Okay. Um, okay, you've got to rest, and then I need etiquette class, and it's got to be more work as a maid, I think. We'll see where that gets us. Uh, rest at home, okay. I never, I uh, haven't ex entertained the idea of sense maybe being an important thing to increase. I don't know. Might be. That was a terrible week of, or time period or whatever, of relaxing. Now the elegance is getting quite high. Say, Father, I have a favor to ask. I would like a fountain pen. Of course. My, I love you so much, Father. Great, okay. More intelligence, that's nice. A bit of sense. Now, the elegance is coming along quite nicely. I'm hoping, because maybe another way into the prince's heart would be winning that contest. Presuming it happens again. Which it may not. Yeah. Probably not actually happening again. Gosh darn. Our elegance is very high. I can't imagine a world where about 800 elegance is enough for anything. That it requires elegance, obviously. Oh, I'm tired. I finally finished it. It's gone! Where did it go? Ah, uh, Lady Rose, I have finished all the work. This is a problem! Our family heirloom, Horn of Unicorn, has disappeared! Uh, yes? Ah, that was really fun. Liron, you are still a child to think that you'd like it this much. This Horn of Unicorn is a fairly family heirloom that was handed down for generations. Oh my, you guys, that's... Ah, uh, Mother... You guys were the ones, Horn of Unicorn, who took the heirloom? Sorry, Mother, it was uh, my fault. <laughs> What's this? I was surprised that we might have had a burglar. Well, that was entertaining. <sighs> okay. My thoughts. Schedule? No. Not rest. Or probably not rest. Actually, yeah, probably rest. Uh, we've only got like 12 weeks left. Let's go to the, the diet center. Dancing. Part-time job. Then palace made a couple times. So we'll see where that gets us. Because the diet center is a fairly cheap class. 
that uh, I believe increases charm. It also decreases weight, which she's been concerned about. Huh. <sighs> What's wrong? I need some uh, consultation. Can you hear me out? Why, of course, if you're all right with me. It feels like my waist has gotten has got bigger these days. See, you see what I mean? Hmm. You're right. I honestly don't think that's something you should worry too much. What do you mean, you're right? So inc so inconsiderate. <sighs> you would never understand this aspect as a human girl. Sh shouldn't have uh, really told me so, then. Oh, now she's concerned about her waist dyes. Oh my gosh. Well, she's going to love the diet center classes I've signed her up for. Day off, go shopping. Good. Great. Oh. Of course, this class doesn't increase charm by that much. It's, it is mostly about the weight loss. Cherry Blossom Festival. This would be the last chance. But at 500 charm, I don't think she's going to win. So might as well not bother. Right? We can try. Trying wouldn't harm anything. We'd be missing out on like three charm because that class actually doesn't do much for charm. Today is the joyous cherry blossom festival. The beauty of a woman is a nation's treasure. Now I shall observe. Oh, I'm uh, getting really nervous. Relax, relax. Even if you don't win, there's nothing to lose. Nothing to lose. Well, I guess that is true. We'll see. Now, everyone, please cast your votes. Yeah, didn't expect a victory here. Honestly, not that far off from one, though, so that's a bit disappointing. Third place again. The winner is Maria. Uh, I would like to pass this honor to my father. The winner will receive the prize money, great. Maria, lady, good job. Please continue being even more beautiful than ever. Third among the eight. Sixth among the eight. Sixth. Yeah. <sighs> I'm so exhausted. Hiya, little miss. Uh, cleaning again today? Oh, uh, you are that person from before. <laughs> you remember me? <laughs> you are quite a strange person. Strange person? I thought the prince would be at the palace, but all I see are strange people. Someone like the prince might be a boring person if you actually see him. That's not true, it's my dream to be married to a prince. Oh, oh, the prince will be really happy to hear that. Really? Are you close with the prince? Uh, no, it's uh, just my imagination. What? I got excited for a second there. I I'm gonna go. <laughs> what an interesting girl. So that's it. That's as far down that, like, line. Dialogue or whatever thing I got previously. 
But I wasn't even trying that time. So I'm, uh... Concerned... With only, uh... Okay. I say we probably have to go into some debt. Study, dance, like there's no tomorrow. What's the status? 87 stress, okay. Actually, I should probably get some rest for Have we get some rest first? There we go. And then we'll study two dancing class and see where that gets us. Okay. I guess, uh... Uh, uh it's extremely hot. Great. Young ladies, free time. Great. Please don't rest at home. When does the stipend come? It should be pretty soon. I think we should have at least one more, right? This heat would take a toll on your body. Pay close attention to your health as we proceed with the lesson. Oh, great. Okay, let's just bring that charm up. I think it's probably charm that we need. If it turns out we need elegance, then... Ah. I'm going to presume charm, though. Young lady's condition seems to be different from usual. Okay. I've been uh, thinking for a while, but I am a bit different from the rest, am I not? Wow, seems like she's feeling very confident. Oh, uh, that might be good. Maybe. She's prideful. And hey, maybe that's just what you need when you want to become a princess. Okay, so on the schedule, I've got three more weeks left. I say one more dance class, and then uh, palace made, and see if we can make it. <sighs> We're just kind of laying it all out here now. Uh, I would save or something, but I mean, honestly, I doubt there's much we could do at this point to change the course in any meaningful way, so uh, let's go. We'll see what happens. What happens, happens, right? Hmm. Hello. Who's this? Say, Augusta. Uh, yes? My name is Chummy. I attend the same dancing class as you. You know me, right? Uh, yes. I've been searching for a rival that is fitting for me. I feel that you are just fit to be my rival. <laughs> what? Rival? Yeah, rival. Let's do our best from now on. Huh? Rival? What is this all of a sudden? Y young lady, you made a friend. That's great. Teacher? Uh, yes, what, what is it, Augusta? What is it, Augusta? Did you also attend dancing classes when you were young? Well, uh, I wanted to, but our family had not enough money. I either taught myself or at least learnt it from others while working. Well, then I am in no doubt you have experience doing part-time jobs as well. Oh, certainly, I have done many of them. What kinds of jobs were they? Well, I will just say many different kinds. Uh, now I need to get going. Already? You're no fun. <laughs> we'll see you in class. Okay. Palace maid. I managed to finally come to the palace, but uh, all I'm doing is cleaning. <sighs> That's no fun. This is new. Of course, that could just be uh, from the pridefulness. 
which might help. I hope it helps. Master, today is Augustus' birthday. Offer a gift? Sure. How about a nice bouquet? Could have probably bought some bouquets or something. Oh, I can smell that nice scent! That scent makes me feel like a butterfly. Okay. Over 600 charm now, maybe that's a magic number. Father, do you have a moment? Father, am I worthy as your daughter? Didn't you ever think I'm not qualified to be a daughter of a highly regarded noble? It worries me, to be honest. I know you cherish your pride. I felt that being myself really hurt your pride and feelings. What, really? You never thought of me that way? <laughs> I feel you are relieved now, Father. Loves me no matter what. That's obvious, but I, I can't really tell, unless you tell me. It would have felt much better if you have told me before. I love you too, Father, and I wish you all the best, uh, uh, as always. That's all I wanted to say. Uh, sorry to bother you. No stress. Great. <sighs> I may just be doing the cleaning duty here, but when I'm here at the palace, I can imagine myself as a princess. Alright, this is your last week to get any events that need to happen to happen. Will it happen? Pro probably not. We probably failed at this. But it's the attempt that matters, right? Well, this is disappointing. My thoughts exactly. Okay. Well, we, we tried. Yeah, she's arrogant. <sighs> Let's chat. <laughs> You don't have to study manners now. I already have enough etiquette. Father, are you happy to have such a good daughter? She she is full of herself. Okay. Well then. Hopefully we got far enough in that event chain. I kind of doubt it though. But hey, the, this is my attempt at a princess run. So uh, let's see. You and Augustus eight years together passed by like a dream. Alright, Augusta. Good luck. Maybe I'm curious to see what you do end up having. A lady who's grown up after going through many complications. Her fate since then is... It's been a month since the lady got hired to work at Mrs. Rose's mansion. I wonder how she is doing. Just a maid. Oh, that's lame. Augusta, take care of the house today, please. Well, uh, we are leaving. Bon voyage, ma'am. Uh, master and lady. Oh boy, they have finally gone out. I'm not the kind of woman to be told to do this or that. I wonder what went wrong to end up working like this. Oh well, should I grab a cup of tea? Oh yes, there was that cake too. She's gluttonous, great. Ever the same. My god, she's seriously grumbling. Hey, no slacking while you are here while you're at work. I became a dancer! Let me know if you would like to come and see my stage. Good for you. Dad, I was able to find a job, and now I feel like I have also become one of the adults. This too must be thanks to all the love you have given me. From now on, with the skills I have learned, I decided to live my life to the fullest. Still, though... I really wanted to become a princess. I wonder where it all went wrong. Is there no hope to become a princess now? 
I guess it was a foolish dream. Well, I will start working hard from tomorrow. I'm going to head to bed for today. Have a good night, Dad. Eh. I feel like we were close. Your daughter has grown up very fine and become a maid at a noble mansion. Having a job and adapting to its environment is one of the basis of human life. Perhaps this is also a form of pleasure living as a human being. Nonetheless, you have done your job as a father. Thanks for your effort. Well then. This was supposed to be a princess run. Um. Hmm. I do wonder what we could have done differently. I feel it took us too long to uh, get her out of that initial uh, super prideful mood. Like that took way too long to get her out of that. Because really we, could, we couldn't start doing much until after we had done that because she wasn't doing well at any jobs. So we couldn't really send her to any classes. I think if maybe, perhaps if we had gotten her out of that mood more quickly we could have done it. And also, I'm not sure. We got about as far through with the, uh... The, uh, conversations with the presumably prince as we did last time, I think. So... I'm not certain what stat we lacked exactly. My guess was charm. It's possible we needed to get up to a thousand elegance, uh, but, or maybe sense. Uh, but ultimately, I think ultimately, the fact that we didn't get out of that mood quickly enough ended up making it so we we're kind of behind for the rest of the game. If we got out of that mood quicker, then perhaps we could have achieved the uh, princess ending, but uh, we didn't. We did not. We got the maid ending, which is a bit a bit dissatisfactory, but whatever. Life goes on. It's better than some of the other endings we could have gotten, surely. But yeah, this has been uh, another playthrough of Princess Maker 3. Uh, if you're still enjoying this and want to maybe see another at some point, so make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And, uh, Whenever Princess Maker 4 comes out, which, by my estimates, by the time this video comes out, should probably be fairly soon. I don't have any insider knowledge, we're just going off of patterns and whatnot. I feel like the next Princess Maker 4 should probably be out fairly soon. Uh, we will definitely be looking at that when that comes out. Who knows, maybe it's already come out by the time this video goes up, and there's already a series on it. That's what's happened with the second playthrough of Princess Maker 1, so who knows, maybe it'll happen again. But, uh, until then, there's going to definitely be something Princess Maker related at some point. So, till then, I've been Simicraft, and I will catch you in that thing. Episode, next episode, next series, who knows. Goodbye.